This is the airship, and this is the airship I recreated in Minecraft. Now, I like the airship very, very much, uh, not least because it gave me my most viewed video by quite a lot. So what we're going to be doing is a tour and overview of the airship just really quickly, uh, because the airship is actually coming out tomorrow, so all you need to know, brief thing, let's do this. This is Cockpit. Cockpit's a cool room because it's got uh, a command board at the front, it's got a few tasks such as divert power and stuff like that. And at the front we've got a very cool vent, this vent is uh, going to vault and to room deck. Uh, it's a relatively OP vent but I'll talk more about that later. Next we have communications. Overall comms is a pretty cool room, it has the comms sabotage and I think it might have a couple of tasks there as well. Not much, just a small cool room. This here is armory, it's comprised of two main sections. A section here for pistols, and a section here for rifles. There's also bits around here for storing the weapons. Here's kitchen. It's got a vent just here, which is connected to the engine room and also to the main hall. And over here is viewing deck. This has a vent which connects to vault and the previously mentioned cockpit. And it also has a plank to eject the crewmates from. Or imposters. I mean, it's usually crewmates because, you know, everyone's so bad at Among Us. Here's the hall of portraits, just a small room, no tasks or anything. And over here's security. We've got cams here, and I think this is a sort of a uh, task, I don't really know what it's about, but it's quite cool. And over here, I don't really want to call it viewing deck because it's not a viewing deck, but just that sort of thing. Over here is electrical. If you thought the electrical in the scales was bad, you ain't seen nothing yet. It has a ladder which leads up to main hall, and its doorways and gateways are different for everybody, so that's going to be a real pain to navigate your way through. Over here is med bay. We've got vitals here, and it's actually comprised of two parts. As you can see, we've got a cool waiting room here. This is Cargo Bay. It's one of the larger rooms in the airship and it has lots of storage. It's got a vent here, which leads over to showers and it leads over to ventilation, which despite being called ventilation, has zero vents in it. Up here, we get to lounge. It has some toilets here and a game room. Now over here's records. This is cool here because this is a one-way vent. It goes to the one I mentioned earlier in Cargo Bay, but it's just a one-way vent. This is one of the first circular rooms in the entirety of Among Us. Now if you come over here, there's showers. Not much in here, however, it serves a cool way to get over to ventilation. This is main hall. It has quite a lot of vents, uh, which makes it a very cool room. This is one of the vents. And here's another. This is the ladder which goes all the way down to electrical. And it has some cool other rooms inside it, like the developing room. And here's engine. This is also one of the biggest rooms and it has a vent right in the middle of it. I tried to rebuild the crane but failed miserably. Here's Brig. I'm not sure why it's called Brig because it's more of a jail cell room, gotta be honest. But if we come over here, we have Vault. Vault has a massive ruby inside it which you need to polish. And it has a vent here which gets all the way to cockpit and later to viewing deck. Now here's Gap Room. It has two vents on either side. This is useful because there's actually a levitating device uh, which makes it hard for crewmates to get across. And the final room is Meeting Room. This is the room with the emergency meeting button. And over here's where you put your enter ID code in. And therefore, I think I've actually done every room. So I hope you enjoyed the airship when it comes out. Please drop a like and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. That'd be really great. And stay tuned for more videos. Bye for now.